Hey everyone, welcome to a new video and today I'm going to do the quests of the Neuro Martians. Uh, Professor Hayden needs our help and Professor Hayden is over there. I'm going to write to him now. Um, yeah, his spider, his uh, spider kind of yeah, pet needs help and I'm going to click on the quest right now. Uh, but um, I need to climb up my horse and try it again. But yeah, my interface is not over here. Now it is, and I'm on my horse, and now I can start the quests. Oh, glittering bugs. Hmm. What do you want, huh? Haven't I already said you're to take your swamp walks in place where I'm not? Can't you see I'm busy? Kids these days. You wonder why it's looking a little chaotic in the camp here? Hmm. Well, at least you can see properly, if nothing else, and the rest you can read by yourself. Um, pick up the brush that's lying on the ground and sweep up the bits of floss. Then talk to Professor Hayden. Um, that's over there. I think uh, I need to take something, but where is the broom? Where is the broom? I need to find the broom, but I can't find the broom. Oh, it's over here, I guess? No. Huh? Where's the broom? Oh, I've got it. Um, good. We're gonna sweep away the gloss. Um, what is this backpack doing here? I don't know. But uh, sweep, uh, sweep away the gloss again, and one more time. And now we're gonna talk to Professor Hayden again. Uh, you can read everything if you, um, yeah, if you do the quests though. Isabella, uh, yes, I'm not gonna read it. Help Professor Hayden to tidy up in the camp. Um, okay, we need to tie it up in the camp. Good, uh, which shit? Oh, it's a little bit chaotic as you can see. Okay, this was everything. Okay, uh, though tricky and terrible taxing. Okay, sleeping in the cold and rain. What do we need to do, Professor Hayden? Tell us. Help Professor Hayden to set up the tent. Okay, how? Pitching the tent. Just click on the tent, okay. Pitching the tent. Okay, the tent is back up. Uh, sleeping in the cold and rain, grateful. You have to be grateful. I call it living. Hmm. Yeah, you live here. That's kind of impossible in the woods and the mirror marshes, but help Professor Hayden to light the campfire. And the campfire is after us and we need the lighter and we're gonna light it up. You all know that song of Major Laser, Light It Up. I mean that um, that song's in my hat now, but nobody really cares, I know it. But uh, what do we need to do next? She's a little long size. Check if Alberta ran over to Professor Hayden's house in Crescent Moon Village. Oh, so we need to go to Crescent Moon Village. So now I'm going to Crescent Moon Village. So we arrived at Professor Hayden's house. And yeah, what's happening over here? Oh, uh, Latte. Seems as though Alberta isn't here. Hey, over here. Oh, we need to go to her. And she's over there. Oh no, no more wasps. Please don't. Oh no, no, please. Oh, I hate those. Ah, the bees are furious. You'd better run over before they attack. Okay. <laughs> but Pamela has something to say. Sorry, what was that? You're looking for Alberta, okay. Raging bees. Set out some sugar water for the bees and be careful to not get close or too close. I think it's better we climb off because maybe the bees uh, are furious or when we... Uh... No. Don't do it. Um, when we put some here. Oh no, shit. I saw it, but I didn't realize. Oh, yay. I know that. Okay, I'm gonna do it again. I need to do two more. Uh, 
Okay, we've done this quest. Ran back to Pamela. And what do we need to do now? What? Again? Why? Oh, no. Oh my gosh, look at those people! It's so funny! <laughs> oh my god, it's so funny! What do we need to do, Pamela? Tell us. Oh my gosh, my character is running over. Um, when sugar's not enough, get Professor Hayden from his camp in the Mirror Marshes. So now we need to go back to the Mirror Marshes, and my horse is over here. Um, I know that red doesn't match us with pink, but I don't really care. Um, so we're now going back to Professor Hayden. So now we're back at it again with Professor Hayden. And I'm going to click on him again because he has some quests for us, as you can see. Um, once upon a time there was a, a spider, I guess. No, we need to climb Bob again. So I'm gonna do that. Stop uh, screen time. Um, let's click on Professor Hayden. Once upon a time there was a a what? Follow Professor Hayden's instruction as you blend together his nectar mixture. Okay. Follow Professor Hayden's instructions. So we're gonna do that now. Um, what do we need to do first? Let's take a look at the ingredients. Pick up the flowers, it's over here. Oh, over there. Uh, okay, which do I need to use? No, what's happening? Um, my English is not very good, but we're pressing, as you can see. Uh, take leaf from the green salad. Put the ingredients in the pasta one mold, like this. Take a couple of slices from the sponge cake. Put the ingredients into the pasta. Ba Pastel and mortar. Take the bottle containing the green liquid. Okay, there. Um, put it in again. I guess I'm mixing now. Stir up. Okay, I didn't saw that. But we're done. Um, Professor Hayden, what do we need to do now? Tell us. I stopped listening. Pour the nectar mixture carefully into the sugar water. Okay. Can I do that? Oh no. This is the most stupid. No, I clicked wrong. Okay, the last one, this. Okay, we've done. Uh, we've done it. Um, what do we need to do now? I always ask that, but he can uh, answer, of course. Chop, chop. What's chop, chop? Um, right to Pamela with the sugar mixture. So now we need to go back to uh, Crescent Moon Village. So I'll see you in Crescent Moon Village. Back in Crescent Moon Village, as you can see, and we're at Pamela, um, Isabella, and not a moment too soon. The bees are going crazy in the village. We need to do something now. Yeah, I'm back at it again with uh, Remedy, or how do you call it? I don't know. Spray the sugar mixture onto the bees and then talk to Pamela. Okay, uh, but do we need to mount off? I don't know, because, oh, no. Okay. The bees are furious, as you can see. Okay, yeah, thanks so much. Okay, um, two more people. You and you. Base breed. Base breed. Um, who was that going totally crazy? Oh, over there. Okay. No time to lose. Woo, that was close, indeed. It was very close. Um, we're gonna, gonna ride back to Pamela, as you can see. Um, what do we need to do now? Talk to Pamela, okay. Whoa, that's too close, I'm so sorry, but you look so weird. Wank is on fleek, by the way, but what is she doing? Kelly, what are you doing? You're so creepy. Uh, but we need to talk to Pamela again. Um, ride out to try and figure out what what's happened. What happened, actually? I guess. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go to Kelly. Kelly, what happened? What happened? Just tell me. Do you know how close it was? I only got away by an inch. Okay. 
You want to know what happened? It was that blasted Alberta again. She's what happened. I was just going to pet her, sniffle, and from now those fangs just appeared, sniff. It was by the skin of my feet that I didn't get her feet in my hand. Boo-hoo. Where she, is she now, sniffle? I'm about to get bitten to death. And you want to know where the little hairball is? Sniffle. What about me? If you have... If you have to know, she ran behind that house where Mrs. Mr. Peach us usually is. Go and find old Berta. Um, it's over here, I guess. Oh, whoa, there's someone behind that house. Hello? Oh my gosh, she's so creepy. I hate spiders, you know? Oh, no. Ugh. Alberta, you're too creepy, girl. Shh, <laughs> That's so weird to do, but that must be Alberta. Okay, Alberta seems nervous. You can't see any fangs on display like Kelly talked about. Maybe it's just as well you pick her up and take her back to Professor Hayden. Oh no, I just don't want to. <laughs> Look at this quest. Oh my gosh, it's so... Alberta shows her giant fangs before attacking. You escape at the very last second. Perhaps the sugar mixture could calm Alberta. Uh, where is she is where is she now? Oh, she's still over here. Oh, we may not ride in front of her because she will bite. Okay. Could calm Alberta down as well. Okay. So we need to find the sugar mixture again, I guess. Okay. Uh, let's go back to Pamela. Um, yeah, talk to us, please. <laughs> Tell me what I need to do. Take the sugar spray back to Alberta. Okay. Many things, but never aggressive. Uh, Alberta is a spider, and spiders are, I guess, always aggressive. But, oh my gosh, Mr. Uh, Miss, Mr. Perch, not Peach, is angry too. Oh, hey, Alberta, you're still here. Oh, no, she's gone. Where's Alberta now? She was right here. Alberta must have run away and hidden while you were over at Pamela's. You've got a feeling she can't have got that far away. Sometimes something feels very wrong. It's best you try to find Alberta as soon as you can. Look for Alberta. Okay. She isn't here. I just know that. Oh, she is here. You see, Alberta is drinking up the sweet nectar, nectar mixture. Together you return to the place you first saw her. Maybe you can take her home soon? Oh, she's so creepy. I don't, I, I don't really like her. Alberta seems to have calmed down. She looks up at you with her big yellow eyes and you get the sense she just wants to go home now. You should let her sit behind you in springtime and take her back to Professor Hayden. No! No, gosh! Oh my gosh, she's so creepy. But now I need to go back to Professor Hayden. So let's go for a ride to Professor Hayden. And we're in the river. That's not what we wanted to do. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I don't really like that spider. I'm so, so, so scared of them. You don't want to know. Um, but now we need to go back to Professor Hayden. Whoa, jump. And yeah, I'll see you soon when I'm back. Memories die out so hard. But we were traveling the mountains. We're back at Professor Hayden and I can't see Alberta, so oh, she's over there. It was so scary, I can't see her. But uh I'm seeing her now. Big yellow eyes. Okay, Professor Hayden, are you happy again? Fetch Alberta's blanket from Professor Hayden's rucksack. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's actually backpack, isn't it? I don't know. Of course you shouldn't be cold. Oh, let's do Alberta, I guess. But how can a spider be cold if most spiders love? Um, yeah. I'm not gonna tell you. Uh, you need to find out on the internet himself. Nothing wrong with Alberta. Okay, there's nothing wrong with her. Talk to Professor Hayden. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow when I can do some more quests. So, bye-bye.
Hey guys, it's the next day, and as you can see, Professor Hayden has some requests. My little sweetie, um, I need to climb off my purse again. Um, but as you can see, I'm almost level 19. I'm so excited for that. But um, I'm now going to do the quest. Examine Alberta then talks to Professor Hayden. Where is she? Oh, she's over here. Um, checking all of it. Oh my gosh. This is so weird. You don't find anything visible wrong with Alberta. I think it's something in her head or something like that. I don't know. Sweetie's blanket. Oh, she needs her blanket. Oh, ride to the vet in Crescent Moon Village. Oh, so I'll see you in Crescent Moon Village when I'm at the vet. As you can see, we're finally. As you can see, we're finally at the vet, and yeah, sweetie's blanket. Camilla Turnstone. Hello there. Oh, take it easy, sweetheart. Breathe. Has something happened? Yes, something that had happened, is happened, or how you want to call it. Um, the chemist from Old Hillcrest. Tell Camilla what's happened. Okay. Oh no, that doesn't sound good at all, Isabella. Uh, yeah, you can read by your own if you do the quests. Ride to the cauldron and look for the green lobster claw plant. Plants from the cauldron. Oh my gosh. That's so far away. Look, it's over here, but it's not easy to get to. So, um, I'm gonna try to get there, so I'll see you soon, guys, when I'm there. see we're finally here and we need to be here though um yeah what's happening here it's a plant okay that must be the green lobster claw plant camilla was talking about um do i need to take leave no pick seed pods from the green lobster claw plant harvesting okay what do i need to do now more oh my gosh there's one more plant over here oh three more oh then we also have everything oh we only need three okay oh there we go that should be enough you're happy with your harvest and start to think about leaving when you hear a strange noise you hear a sound from the cave should you take a closer look look closer in the cave Oh gosh, I actually don't want to, but if the quest says I need to, then I'm going to do that, of course. Like, where is the cave? Is this the cave? No, I don't believe that. Where is the stupid cave? I can't go there. Can I? Oh, there. Oh. I'm gonna try to. And if it doesn't turn out well... Oh, she was already there. Okay. What's happening in here? Oh my gosh. No more spiders, please. It's like, oh no. God damn it. Yellow eyes. I don't want to. Yellow eyes. Okay, where is the quest? Alberta, is that you? What are you doing here? Oh, it's Alberta. Oh my gosh, no more spiders. That's definitely... That's definitely not Alberta. Your gut feeling tells you that this is bad. Oh no. We need to run. Oh my gosh. 
Ugh. Okay, we need, we need to raise when spiders back. Oh my gosh, so terrible. Ugh, I hate spiders. So damn hard. You just don't want to know how much I'm afraid of those spiders. Look out, spiders. Oh no. Oh. No shit, sure. Like I thought I was cough, but I wasn't. Okay. <sighs> More spiders. Oh, we need to go the other way. No shit. No, 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 horse, no. Oh. Horse, please. Oh my gosh, spiders all the way. Okay, come on. Race. A bit faster, darling. Springtime. Come on. Go for the spiders. Oh my gosh. So terrifying. Okay. Are there some more spiders? But where? Oh my gosh, they always attack. Oh, over there. Oh my gosh, it's a big one. I don't want big ones to attack. Oh my god. <sighs> so stressy, this. Ah, not normal anymore. Uh, this is what I said, like, where it doesn't match us with the uh, or thing. Oh, we need to go here. To, I don't know what this is. Is this old Nilcrest? To, woo, you did it. Best to write to Hayden's camp now and tell him everything. So now we're going back to Hayden, so I'll see you soon. Bye, Hayden. Waiting for the summer, knowing there's nowhere to go. We're back at Hayden and also Camilla is here. Um, what do you need? There you are. Thank goodness you made it. Did you get the seed pots? What's happened? You look like you've seen a ghost. No, I saw spiders. Ugh, so I have no words for that. Um, but this is what I meant with uh, red not matching with pink, but nobody really cares. But yeah. Oh, I didn't think of that. Silly me. It's the time of year that the Yorvigian giant spiders come out to let their eggs hatch. They stay around the cauldron because it's nice and warm for them there. Sorry for forgetting to mention that, Isabella. You got the speed. You got the seed pots anyway? Hmm, I wonder. Isabella, could you please feed some of the fruits from the seed pots to Alberta while I try to take a blood sample of her? You have the seed pots to Alberta, then talk to Camilla. Okay. Yes, I can. But you need to wait a little bit. Okay, seed pod. How many do I need? Oh, one. It's not very difficult. Oh my gosh, I'm feeding Alberta over here, but Alberta is over there. Weird, but something else. There we are. Now I've got a bloat sample from Alberta. It'll take no. It it'll not take long to get a result from this. If you just wait a short while, you will see if my suspicions are correct. I guess they're correct. <laughs> Yep, exactly as I thought, Isabella. When you told me about the spiders at the cold run about, and about their eggs, I started to think that perhaps Alberta wasn't sick. And I was right. She's expecting eggs. Um, Hayden, I've never seen you smile before. You look almost scary. Haha, <laughs> I'd love to stay, but I need to get back now. I'll be back later to check on Alberta. Make sure she get gets plenty of food and rest now. It's difficult to say when exactly she'll be ready to lay her axe. Now I've really got to go. Lovely to meet you, Isabella. Bye. Talks to Professor Hayden. So actually, Alberta is pregnant. Oh my gosh, so weird to think about. I'm, I'm very, very curious what Professor Hayden thinks about this. A positive test. Um, I'm, I'm going to be granddad. Oh no shit. I think he loves it. I'm gonna be a granddad. Isabella, don't you get it? I'm going to be a granddad. Alberta, you're going to be a mother. My little sweetie is all grown up. Mm, of course, by the way. This isn't a present, just in case you start getting ideas. I got delivered to my address by mistake, and, to young, and the young man in the post office won't let me return it. 
kids these days. Always kids these days. Oh my gosh, we're gonna get a pants. Cool terrain trousers. A gift from Hayden, which, according to him, wasn't a gift. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There you go. Yes, well, it does rather seem as though, as though Alberta likes you. And that this has to be Isabella. Now she needs a little peace and quiet. But I'll let you know when the eggs arrive. Okay. He's gonna let me know when the eggs arrive. Very, very, uh... Curious, but look at this pants, the cool terrain trousers. It's not something I would wear, but it matches with a set I saw before. So I'm gonna wear them, and you're getting 355 uh, Yorkshire shillings if you sell it. But I'm gonna wear it now. It matches with my t shirt a little, but not with my set now, but nobody really cares. So, uh, yeah. Thank you for watching. I hope I'll see you in the next episode of Star Stable Quests. Yeah, bye bye. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to leave a nice comment, and I'll see you next time with a new yeah, episode of these Star Stable Quests. Bye!